The Stereogenics plant in Smyrna is on the hot seat once again, this time because company officials kept quiet about a recent link of toxic gas that prompted employees to evacuate the building. CBS 46's Rebecca Schramm is live this morning. She's at the facility. The governor is now weighing in on uh, what's happening here, Rebecca. Yeah, Gravier and Tracy, yesterday Governor Brian Kemp tweeted that state regulators have now opened an investigation into that leak that happened here a few weeks ago. And all of this is signaling that the state and the county are having trust issues right now with company officials. Take a look at what we saw yesterday evening. Right outside the Sterogenics plant was an emergency response vehicle from the State Department of Natural Resources. We learned the team responded after a, report, a reporter got a copy of an internal company email discussing a leak of ethylene oxide that happened July 31st. It prompted an evacuation of the facility. Company officials said it was a small leak of the cancer causing gas, only five pounds or so. They're required to report to uh, any leaks to the state that are more than 10 pounds. So this one went unreported. The frustration is that the company president stood before county commissioners Monday and made no mention of that leak. Commissioner Bob Ott tells CBS 46 things are going to change now transparency wise. But I think the important part moving forward is that uh, that I have asked for and they have agreed to provide now on a monthly basis everything that happens in that plant that is not reported to the EPD. And commissioners took an extra step. They are now asking the company for a list of every single leak that has happened in the past five years, no matter how small the amount. Live in Smyrna, Rebecca Schramm, CBS 46 News.